everybody, it is your boy Vertex, and welcome back, and today, we are doing... <laughs> part 10. 10 digits, I mean not 10 digits, double digits, guys, of Horizon Forbidden West. Everyone, I have an announcement to make. I am back. I've been gone for 13 days. Last video on Horizon was two weeks ago. I was sick, I was lazy, I am back. Last time we left off guys, we, um, what's it called? We brought back, we brought back Gaia, this lovely queen right here. And now we're gonna go technically find her other parts of herself. And, um... So we chose, uh, we chose to go with this one. I, yeah, we, okay, we're gonna exit the, we're gonna exit the base. Um, how do we, where is the exit? Okay. <clears throat> no, we're gonna exit the base. Okay, I need to bring Ether back for Gaia. Varl and So are waiting for me by the west exit. But I could head back east first, check on how Plainsong's doing after the attack. Or I could also look around here some more. Listen, there's a lot to do. <coughs> you guys hear me like my throat? I am still sick. Ish. Sickish. Sickish. You know, I'm kind of sick. I'm not. Um, where do we go? Um, uh, exit from the west. I I went the wrong way. I went the wrong way. <clears throat> My bad. So guys, it is good to be back. I apologize for the inconvenience of me being sick and just me getting caught up in. School and I think it'll be better this way. okay, what am what am I doing? After you, Aloy. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed the series and have an amazing day. This looks beautiful. I need to head further west to um get more of Gaia's components, make her stronger. You two can stay here in the meantime, and Gaia can help get you up to speed. I'm not trying to shut you out. This, it's like training. Actually, I'm gonna go back east to get Erend. Bring him here. Look, allies. Friends can help. We have a place to stay now. And like you said, Gaia can teach us. Catch us up. It'll be okay. Okay. Take these then. One to wear, one for backup. Are you going with him? No. After what happened in the cave below, I want to stay here a while. There is much I need to understand. Maybe by the time you get back, I'll have a thing or two I can teach you. Looking forward to it. When will you be back? I'm, uh, I'm not sure. But hopefully I'll have one of Gaia's missing components with me. Be careful out there. Even in Plainsong, we heard how the Tanakh clan lands are suffering from storms, machines, and now Regala. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Good hunting, Aloy. I'll have to find more machine sites to get the parts I need. I 100% like this one better than the first one. Oh, God. <clears throat> We're gonna have to do the... the head thing. Is that what it's called? I, I'm bad with names, guys. 
We get to the, the tonic. Yes, that's what it's called. We have to do the tonic. Um. You. Beep. Let me take a look at you, stranger. X, X. I do not want you to look at me, stranger. What is this? Now I really like how they really made it easier to climb stuff. You can really climb anything in this game now. Okay, maybe not everything, but a lot more than you could back then. And um I love it. I love the glider. Probably one of the best things this game has. Uh, the open world is amazing. It's just, it's amazing. Man, I remember playing the first one like a year ago, or almost a year ago, and it was amazing. And me being, me playing this one now, like a year later, or almost a year later, it is amazing. To see. Just gonna, you know, be a little bit stealthy. Don't want to, um. Don't want to die. Oh. <clears throat> okay, we can make our way up. So guys, Platonic is like, you know, a cellular tower, you know, we need it so we can get a better look of the map, so as much as I don't want to waste too much time and like do the main mission, because I've been gone for a while, I also want to see the map, so hopefully this Platonic won't take too long. Um, I am starting a new channel, guys, a second channel called Vertex Jr. I'll be posting more family-friendly content on there. Um, right now I'm doing Spongebob. Um, first video should be out, hopefully by the time you see this, of me playing the whole line with Alan. Um, if you change, the video's having some issues, so I might have to do it again, though. Sucks, but um, it should be out hopefully very soon. And um, oh god, they're taking a lot of damage. Here. And very soon I'll start playing the main story of that game as well. Um, I'm excited. I've always wanted to kind of have a channel or just a playthrough of the game that a little bit more for a younger audience makes me feel like a kid again. And I know I can, do it, I can do it on this channel, but I really don't want to be, like, weird. Like, you know, all the games I post is, like, more mature. Like, I don't know how to just switch out of nowhere to family-friendly. And I don't want a kid to be watching this channel and then seeing all the other stuff. So, I'd rather have a separate channel for more family-friendly stuff. And we'll be seeing that on the second channel. Vertex Jr. <clears throat> Go check it out. Now, how the heck do I get up here? What? What do you mean there's no way to get up this thing? No, we, there needs to be a way to get up this thing. I'm trying to think. Come on, there's always a way. Right? There's always a way. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think there's a way. He is killing animals. Yeah, I think we really can do this. 
That really does suck. That means that we can't really see that much. Oh, so that's pretty. I think in the future, we should be able to get up that tall neck. I think right now we can't even. The character said it, you know, there's no way to get up it, so. Uh, don't want to waste time on that. Another day. We'll do it. If I'm rusty. But there's probably gonna be enemies here, guys. If I'm rusty. I'm sorry. It's been two weeks since I posted Horizon. And it's been 13 days since I last recorded. So I have been gone for a long, nah, I've been gone for a while. If I ever go on vacation, guys, um, my goal is to have videos planned for you guys, scheduled and released. Um, you know, if it's like out of nowhere, like, I just, like, one day, like, I need some time to, like, plan videos for you guys and stuff like that. Which, there's a good chance I might go somewhere in the summer. If I do, I, I will have videos planned, don't worry. On both channels, I do want to have videos ready for you guys. Um, I'm hoping that will happen. Oh, these are jets. These are... Like, this is some ancient stuff right here. This is a j literally a jet, I'm pretty sure. It looks like a jet. So this is where the guy and it's a freaking Tanox. Turned into a Tanox stronghold. Oh. Could Ether be inside? Poking around's not gonna be easy with Tanox warriors everywhere. You guys are not gonna be nice. Are to us at the embassy this much is true but oh you guys are Gala's forces may seem strong now i thought you guys were kill me took out my entire squad remember the visions the old ones didn't choose their fight but still <coughs> they stood firm they didn't falter and neither will we blood of the ten You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh, the warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Lai. <laughs> yes, you are known to us. I am Deka, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's, there's something I need here. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Is that oh. the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the chief. I really do not want to talk to the chief. <clears throat> okay. These please. visions. You said they're the records of the ten. Who are they? Old ones. Who fought a heroic battle against machines on this very soil long ago. Their deeds are honored in the visions. <laughs> At least what remains of them. To be remembered and exalted. There used to be more of these visions? Many more. Once this place was filled with light and sound. But over the years, they've fallen into darkness. One by one. That is why chaplains are so important to the tribe. We remember all we can of the visions. Etched in our flesh. Passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. One day the whole grove may go dark. But chaplains who come after me will keep the memories alive. Why does Hikaru want to see me? We are at war with Regatta. And you've already shown that you can stand against her. 
I'm not here to fight a war for you. Not for us. With us. But I won't try to persuade you. That is for the chief. He can be very convincing. I see. What does it mean to be a chaplain here? We who outlast our youth study the visions and share their wisdom with our young. What kind of wisdom? How to be a true warrior. To fight with bravery and unflinching honor. And to know when to call for peace. You can see for yourself when we go inside. Oh, it's time to go inside. All right, let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room at the far end of the grove. Come, be welcome among the records of the town. It's glitched. Incomplete. We're gonna fix it. The ten were dedicated soldiers, working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. I can't use my focus. There we go. There was something hidden here. Yeah, I know I saw something. There's a lot of, a lot of stuff here. You know, want to get as much as I can. <laughs> Soldiers in a jungle. Those were the ten? Yes. They knew how to use the jungle's depths to distract the enemy until the perfect moment to strike. Generations ago, my clan, the Lowland, looked to this one for inspiration as they claimed the jungle to the southwest. Okay. <clears throat> I could probably talk to you now. Right? Yeah, I can. Okay, I'm not there. Please, Could you help me fix this No. Not today. I love, I'll love to though. Totally love to. The chief is inside. Are you ready to see him? No. I want to look around more first. As you will. Thank you for just coming on my face like that. Like, not weird at all. God darn it. Instead of a gun. Thank you for not following me. <clears throat> there's, there's two more. Oh, want to see them all? Okay, so that's all the visions. Oh, you know what? We'll go help the girl with the box. We'll see. If it's quick, then we'll do it. Hey, I'll help you. You have an old world recording? This box was speaking with voices of the old ones. 
Now there's noise over them. Let me take a look. Where did you find this? We took it from an Asaram Delver. She was trying to steal it, and other artifacts from Tanakh territory. The others were going to bury it in the sand with her. But then I heard the voices. Well, the data here is badly corrupted, but... Delta Juliet 9, you are weapons free and clear to engage the swarm. Good hunting. Copy that. We'll buy Zero Dawn the time you need. Delta Juliet 9, out. The voices of warriors from the past. And that Osiram wanted to sell them for shards. The bravery of the Ten should be remembered. I'm not sure what you mean by the Ten. These voices came from the final battle of the Old Ones. Another battle? I could learn more about it if I could find the other boxes. That Delver did say there might be more recordings to be found in the wreckage of ancient flying machines. She claimed she had a way to locate them. Yeah. The box with the voice data on it is emitting a locator signal. I could use it to find the others. If you do then, bring them back here. I will see to it that they're treated with proper respect. Whatever sacrifices were made by these ancient soldiers, we will honor them. Okay. If I find more of those recordings, I'll bring them back to you. So that's just a new collectible. My focus can detect patterns <clears throat> from those recording devices. Should help me to find any others that are still out there. The chief waits beyond. Ready? I'm yep. ready. Good. Come. I'm here. Where's the chief? See you soon, Outlander. Oh, it's you. The savior of Meridian. I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta. In single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior. A man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. What? <clears throat> Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of Marshal slain. I count hundreds more to knock them, whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now? And taking what I need to save everyone? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. 
Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Root. I've sent out a call for the competition. But since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. To defend the Cool Root. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Tecote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit. Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold a cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Cathala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. Yeah, I hate you. <laughs> yeah, I'll go north. I don't want to waste too much time. I'll do what you want, and go north to deal with Dakota. But you'd better not forget about our deal. You will have what was promised. If you succeed, speak to Deco on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. You, I... Oh. Deca? Deca? I, I gotta... Well, I gotta talk to you. I gotta... I gotta... Can I just... Not just break in there, man? Deca! De Deca? What else do you need? Nothing, it's just it's glitch. I should go. Dismissed. I d d Deca? Deca! You glitched on me now. Deca! Deca! Deca, can I? God darn it, Deca! This one's harder, that's why I, I, I'm not, I'm not gonna go to this one actually. Yeah, that one's way harder. I went too far, I just wanted to see if they will kind of like reload. Yeah, you're still glitched. You can't begin without the Sky Clan's challenges. Takote must be brought to heat. De Deca! God darn it, man. I hate it when these people just have to glitch in the worst spot in the whole Frickin' ah, very annoying. <clears throat> okay, guys. So um, we know what we're doing next episode, and a little bit of this episode. Deca, see this? There we go. Deca is good. He's good now, guys. Deca's good. Do this. Okay, now Deca wants to actually listen. Just... Come, let us speak. Hikaru said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. Ooh. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's revels in the area. Machines and revels. Nothing I haven't faced before. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend it slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. Thank you, I, I, I guess. Enough. 
in, in a nice way. If I'm gonna get ether, guess I'll have to play along with Akaro. I better meet up with Marshal Catalo at Stone. I've obtained a snap something 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 bell. Okay, I 100% want to use that. <laughs> Be faster if I ride a machine. That's if we find a machine. Oh, I already see the problem here. I can't use fire. I only have six bullets. What's this place? Can we ride these? No, I think we can. <clears throat> We're on the road. Yes, we are. We're on the road. Yes, we are. Forget to go. Good sky clan. We're on the road. Yes, yeah. Will we make it? And that's the question. That's the question that we're all wondering. Oh, oh. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And I uh, rejoin this amazing series. So let's go, let's go, let's go to the Sky Clan. A long, long, what the f is that? That, that's nice. It's slow. Did I? It, it, it's pretty low. Please, stranger, help me kill this thing. The heck was that? Oh, you know what? I have to. I'm I'm taking you down. Excuse me. Is he talking to me? Yeah, yeah, we're not. That feels good. But I'm gonna go back to my old one. That one actually had acid ammo. Which I think I have a lot of that. <clears throat> yeah, look at the switch. Oh, I should have put that on bow there. That's more smart. Of course, you guys aren't friendly. They escaped. They could do it again. There has to be some sign. You're not going to be jumping all watch, are you? Yeah, we're leaving. You are new. You have fire canister on your back. God. We're going. Come on. Where are we going? <laughs> I don't know why he turned around. Very offensive of him. Or it. Let's 
getting steeper, air is getting cold. Should be getting close to Stonecrest. For a second, I thought you were gonna kill me. Oh, upstairs. We're almost there. Reminds me of um the DLC. Like the snow area. In the first game. I really love it how the map is different. Shit, are these Enemies? Crap, it is enemies. I see you. So, hi. It's so hard to tell which one's the enemy and which one's trying to help me. Never ambush me. Together the Sky Clan. Not one more step. The Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in the clan lands. I was given right of passage by Marshal Fashav. I'm not here to fight. They're like blood. This is the warrior who defeated Gruda, champion of the traitor Regala. Her life is not ours to take. You may enter, but mind our ways. You will be watched. I'll keep that in mind. This must be Stonecrest. Oh, so that's me. okay. But Whoa. What'd you do? Ah, the wandering outlander. Come, trade. Yeah, I don't really want to trade. I just really want to. Do what I must. There's Catalo. Let's talk to you. Come and trade. This valley is infested with Regalus rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride, others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts, especially cannons. The path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Oh! <laughs> what is this place? Stonecrest was built as an outpost, back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on.
For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders, an outlander and a maimed marshal aren't gonna change his mind. Your chief seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here, talking to you. What makes you so sure Takote won't listen to us? A snake safe in its lair hears nothing but its own rattle. Come on, is that all you've got for me? Hikaru said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Takote is a petty, vindictive schemer. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead, he covets the chiefdom from behind the bulwark. Biding his time. Hoping that his foes will weaken one another. Is that enough for you? No. For now? What makes the bulwark so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders, impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only thing that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. No, we're not done here, buddy. Why do you think Regala's forces are driving <clears throat> machines through the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds. But whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. An override with two phases. I... Don't know about that. But it gets worse. We've heard rumors that the Rebels are scouting larger machines. I don't know what kind. Let's hope they don't learn how to override them, too. Hmm. You were at the Embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other Marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <clears throat> You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. Good thing you're on my side, then. <laughs> so, what's the plan? The bulwark is to the southwest. So undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Regala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. Hmm. Let's get this over with. Okay. So guys, that is what we're doing next episode. Oh, the snow's coming down high. I don't fight so, um... Yeah, guys, we're getting it off there don't want to make the video too long it is good to be back um hopefully next episode we'll get more done uh there was a lot of walking met a lot of people but it wasn't almost action looks like ne next episode will be a little bit more intense which i'm excited for hope you enjoyed see you all in the next one goodbye